All right, well, starting tomorrow, more New Yorkers will be eligible for a COVID vaccine. Yes, the governor lowered the age limit today. CBS 2's Dick Brennan live at the Javits Center with more on this. Dick? Yeah, Christina Maurice, the Javits Center this weekend was the largest vaccination center in the nation. It was open 24 7. In the meantime, all across New York State in the last seven days, a million doses have been distributed. That means the supply is on the upswing. But the governor says the supply will ebb and flow. In the meantime, though, now he's increasing eligibility. If the supply is increasing, we can then increase our distribution. Levels. So, because there will be more vaccine to go around, Governor Cuomo is lowering the age for eligibility for the vaccine from 65 plus to 60 years old plus, and they can now make appointments starting at 8 a.m. Wednesday. And starting next Wednesday, March 17th, all sites can vaccinate anyone who's eligible. Whether you go to a county or city run site or anywhere else, you can get the COVID shot. There is one exception pharmacies will be doing 60 plus and teachers. Why? Because the pharmacies, uh, it's not as easy for them to identify different types of workers, et cetera. They can identify age, because age you can identify by just the driver's license. And President Biden, rightfully so, has made teachers a priority. So called public facing employees become eligible too, including government workers, nonprofit workers, and essential building service workers. These are the people who are the everyday heroes who are out there doing their job, they're putting themselves in a possible position of exposure. The governor also says COVID-19 has hit the black and Latino communities much harder than others. He says these populations have had less trust in the vaccine and the system as a whole, and he invited pastors to make the case to get a shot. About the symptoms or the side effects, I said to uh, my congregation, I would rather have a side effect than have to go to the cemetery. And my prayer is that if you're not going to take the vaccine, please don't talk other people against it. Now, so far, 19% of New Yorkers have gotten at least one shot. 10% are fully vaccinated. So we've got a long way to go. We're live at the Javits Center. Dick Brennan, CBS 2 News. Okay, Dick, thank you.